Hi, it's Paul from Wave5Trade.com and this is my daily stock signals video for Wednesday the 20th of June. I'm going to look at um, one of our signals from our members area. Our members get potential long fifth wave trades, short fifth wave trades, stochastic longs and stochastic shorts every day in downloadable spreadsheets. I'm looking at the longs today. Uh, I'm going to be looking at the 60 minute time frame. Our members simply click on the image here and download the spreadsheet each day. Let's have a look at what the spreadsheet looks like for today for the longs. So I've chosen a 60 minute time frame today. I've chosen one of these particular stocks in our signal service here for a potential long fifth wave trade. Uh, on the 60 minute time frame, fifth wave is the highest probability move in an Elliott wave sequence within a trend. So let's have a look at the chart. So I've chosen Disney on the 60 minute here. I've had a nice pullback um, over the last few days and found good support on the wave four here. Now, the um, data is filtered slightly. Um, for our members giving three main filters that the wave four has pulled back into one of our probability zones in this case it's in the green zones an 85 percent probability Disney is going to go on and make a new wave five high around about 110 50 or something like that into our automated target zone up here in blue the 535 is the next uh, filter this is pulled back between 90 and 140 percent and as you can see down here in red it's, it's crowning in that area and the stochastic has pulled back against our false breakout dots here so the false breakout dots denote a really strong trend on this time frame and then we've pulled back against there and crossed over in the oversold zone so the likelihood is it wants to go back and return to that main bullish trend so to set this up is very very simple on this 60 minute time frame the stop loss is below the wave 4 pivot and that's about 105.68 now usually our entry is above the 6-4 moving average high the green moving average here which is our conservative entry position but I want to go above the highs of the previous day on Monday here where it was very range bound so I just want to make sure that the momentum is bullish again so 107.58 is the entry long for Disney with the target around about a, uh, right in the middle of our target zone there is 110.61 uh, which is a 1 to 1.6 risk to reward so very good risk to reward for this potential long trade now this could go in a day or two days so um, it's had a very very uh, narrow range uh, each day and now we're looking for that support level to consolidate and to move up so 107.58 is the long entry for Disney. So that's it for today. Have a great trading day and I'll speak to you all tomorrow.